Hi right, boys and girls, Matt the Real Toy Shop. What have we here? Well, this is something I thought I'd hang on to it, to be fair. But, you know what I'm like, I can't keep them all. Piaggio Ape 50. This one lived its life in Portugal and was reputedly the mayor of a certain town in Portugal. It was his vehicle and it was imported to the UK many years ago and uh, where it lived in a collection there's Kimmy down there look staying out the way don't want to be on film a bit shy anyway imported many years ago into a collection and uh, we bought it out of the collection along with another one of these for a pickup but this one is the van and uh, yeah it's lovely absolutely lovely anyway we've gone to the trouble of um, getting it all registered and everything so you can go on the road we just MOT'd it I'd say about a month ago and yeah it's cool as custard good thing about this one it actually was serving its life in the collection here uh, being a wedding prop so if you wanted your wedding photos taken in the back of a Piaggio Ape this was your one down there's a little heater that plugs into the fag lighter your jacks around here look living in there but the interior it's gorgeous isn't it absolutely gorgeous that slam obviously it's the earlier single headlight model it's a 1994 on an m as you've probably seen from behind the back new tires all around look at underneath it look at it and i had a better back to the mot center in this and it, it was hilarious um it really really was so all the new tyres all around it, interior, as we say, it's like brand new. Well, brand new is probably, you know, someone always moans, don't they? But yeah, brand new to me anyway. It's done 1,905 kilometres, so work that out. That probably comes to, is it roughly eight or 900 miles? Nothing, absolutely nothing. And as you can see, bah, like sort of the surface rust on the engine parts and bits and bobs, it really, 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 really is in nice nick. So, yeah, there's your truck. Right, let's have a look at the back, shall we? So it's like a Range Rover, it's got a split tailgate. And in there, look, you could sit in there and get your picture taken with your beloved. Over here, we have tailgate. Whoop. See if we can get that down. Come on, Matt. Get your fat thumbs out. No. What am I doing wrong? Ah, there we go. I'm not letting it go. Look, that. What a donkey. Look, so on the side here, some little clips. And I'm clipping it. And I'm not clipping it. I'm... So there she is. She's down. Dropped that a bit heavy, didn't I? Anyway, it's down. Didn't hit anything. There's nothing to hit, to be fair. So, as you can see, didn't hurt a thing. Didn't hurt a thing. Here, look, we have a bicycle pump. How cool is that? That's a Piaggio bicycle pump. You need that. You really do. Well, how cool is that to have? I mean, let's be fair. I would think many of those have gone the wrong way over the years so that's us bolting her down look happy days there's all your plastic roses i haven't put fresh ones in i'm sorry so they don't smell of roses and again pump her down so how cool is that i don't know you decide you might think it looks absolutely awful i don't mind because i like it looks great next to the big old caddy next to it and the other one that we had, I mean, that one, it went pretty well. And the guy's using it, lovely advertising machine, which is what they should be for. So an LED light conversion in there, so it's not going dull and stuff as you're, you know, running down the road. As these, you know, anyone who's had a moped can testify. The lights go dull at the lights, at the traffic lights, not, you know, at the lights. And uh, you feel a little bit vulnerable. So this one, as you can see... LED in the front anyway right then let's give her a little go 
So down here, as you so when you've got it as well, down here is a choke. See that? Choke. Right. How do you operate the thing? Well, I'm ginormous, aren't I? Absolutely huge. So, works just like a Vespa, manual gears, clutch in, twist the throttle grip. That is your reverse. So pull that over to you. That's your reverse. And then it got four reverse gears. So how cool is that? We've got some little lights in there. They just want some batteries in, I think. That one's still going, look. So you can see what's going on in here. They're add-ons. We've got an ashtray, never used, and a fag lighter. Yeehaw, look at that. Fag lighter, but that's more good to plug in the heater. So let's get some ignition on, for which you get no lights and that'll properly trick you. So whether she'll go without choke, I don't know, but we'll see. Yes, folks, I did warm her up a little before we got going, so motorbike throttle. Will she keep going? Well, she is for now. What you guys can't get is the smell. Smell of the two-stroke. Absolutely wicked. That probably looks like it's flickering on here. It's not, but obviously, camera's at a funny frequency to light, so you get it. It fucking makes it look flickery. It would do. Now, I wonder if I can do that from the other side. That'd probably be better for you, wouldn't it? Dog's looking at me like I've absolutely lost the plot. Anyway. I don't know if you can see the exhaust from there, but you can certainly hear it, can't you? Let's turn her off before I get absolutely smoked out. So, it's your little Ape. What's Ape mean? Ape means B. Yep, in Italian. Wasp is Vespa, B is Ape. So, this is the little Piaggio B50. Oh, there goes the pooch. Look, he, he, he's looking at it. He's saying, oh, can I go in the back? No, you can't go in the back, security dog. You're not allowed. Elvis won't fit, so he can't go in it either. So that's your little truck. Like you say, 1995, 94, sorry, on an end plate. 50cc little Ape from Portugal, lived its life there and then gone into a collection. So, helps its condition, make great exhibitional vehicles, great for the coffee shop, all that good stuff. So, what can we do for you? If you've got a little Part X, just hit us up on uh, therealtoyshop.com and on there we've got a Part X form and if you can fill that in, that'd be fantastic. That way, I've got all the things I need to know about your Part X. Um, that's all we can offer you really, this one, we could try financing it for you, we use close brothers, quick decisions, good rates, all that good stuff, but it may be that it's too old, maybe all sorts of things, they can get funny finance companies because, you know, it's not left hand or right hand drive, is it? You know what I mean? They're mad. Anyway, we can try for you, uh, and if you've got to ask your missus first, get her ass first before you give us a call. All we have with this, some Portuguese paperwork, uh, V5, new MOT. And keys, of course. And the other thing, the pump. But there you go, there's its little Portuguese dubra jigs telling you something. That's it. So that's us, boys and girls, number one. If you've got a Pardex, get that form filled in. And then number two, it's just a case of giving us a ring. We could try and help out with delivery. Uh, I have a car trailer and stuff like that here, so if you need a bit of delivery, give us a shout. But prefer you always come and have a look. It's better that way. But on that note, I'm out of here. Off to do something else for me uh, Saturday afternoon. Thanks for watching. And don't forget, ask your missus first. Bye for now.